Hello again and welcome to Let Jesus Drive. Welcome on board. I trust that you are doing very well. Today for our devotional I'd like to talk about something that is very interesting. My topic is two sides to every story two sides to every story there are some individuals who believe that there are three sides the right side the wrong side and the best side but um, I'll focus today on there are two sides to every story and I'd like to come from the perspective of a leader. You see, a leader should take into consideration that there are two sides to every story. We all have been there. You are being given a convincing retelling of an event by one party. The story is sound. The case seems very clear. You know, you are already predisposed to act accordingly. Then you suddenly hear the other side of the story and realize that things are never that simple if you're a leader right you need to learn the wisdom of waiting to get the whole picture that is very very important don't rush to judgment upon hearing the first recounting of an incident you have to be very careful wait to find out more give it some time and so if it's a dispute between two parties wait to hear the two sides of the two party right do not be predisposed to judge in one direction even if the person before you is a good friend of yours and a personal favorite or someone you deem to be trustworthy and credible somebody who you know and believe in wait and stay objective and this is very important to stay objective act when you have as much knowledge of the matter as much as possible listen to this one writer says some here years ago and I, human beings are not truth tellers they are survivors they tell the story that fits their own narrative not the objective truth and once you know this you will pause before judging some individuals like to judge they just love to judge as they hear something they just run with it and so and you will become a better and a wiser leader I quote this individual again human beings are not truth tellers they are survivors and so let the peace of God reign in your heart let it override the situation that you are about to deal with put Jesus before everything that you do and remember when you are about to deal with a conflict you know remember to always pray let 
Jesus Drive. Have a wonderful day.